Andrew McKay has joined us on CFC TV for an injury update. I understand Matthew Cruiser did train today. How did he pull up? Yes, yeah, obviously, as everyone knows, Matthew uh, had a good hit out today. Unfortunately, he didn't get through training uh, and has pulled up a little bit sore. So with that, what is the prognosis for this weekend and going forward? Yeah, so we had a long meeting with um, club doctor and Matthew today and also involved his specialist, of course. We think the best course of action is that he actually gets the foot fixed up once and for all, goes into surgery and has the uh, surgery, which will mean that he's going to be out for somewhere between 12 and 14 weeks, which is uh, really disappointing, but certainly it's the best thing for Matthew and best thing for the club. So what will actually happen in that surgery? Uh, as far as I'm aware, we'll take the surgeon will take the screw out, the screw that's already in there. Uh, he'll have a bone graft on the inside of the, of the fracture site, uh, put a plate over the top and then have uh, more bone graft filling in the deficit of the fracture that hasn't healed. I imagine Cruiser must be devastated by the news. Yeah, obviously Matthew's very, very disappointed but uh, in saying that he understands it and, and realises that it needs to be fixed up. Uh, you can't go on all year feeling in this much discomfort every time he trains. So, he needs, needs to get it fixed, we need to get it right so he can come back stronger and better than ever later on in the year. So later on in the year there is a good chance that he can return? And yeah, we're very hopeful that um, certainly it'll be very late in the year. Um, I think 12 to 14 weeks is you know, probably around, around 16, 17. So we're hopeful he'll be back by then. But obviously we'll just have to see how the surgery goes and how everything goes on. All going well, we'll be back for, uh, before the finals this year. Andrew McKay, thanks for your time. Thank you.